discretion is advised. This is a dangerous group. Hey guys, it's your Queen SG, and welcome back to the Continental Espionage Channel. Now today you guys are in for a special treat. I want to show you my laundry routine. You'd be surprised how many people I came across who, you know, just left home, going to college, and they have no idea how to do their own laundry. So I'm going to show you this quick, efficient way to do laundry. To skip all the confusions between the tags and what goes with what, we're going to take care of all of that today. But before I get started, I just need you guys to do those four things for me. Like, subscribe, hit that notification button, and drop a comment. You know why I appreciate you think that was cool? it. So we're going to jump right into it. Okay guys, so I separated my two piles. I typically like to do them in the whites and the darks. Now today, I'm going to be doing the darks first because I've noticed in the past when I tried to do the lights first, I add the bleach into it and then I turn around and try to do the darks right after it. Some of my darks will come out bleached, you know, due to the bleach residue that's left inside the washing machine. So we're going to flip it today. I'm going to do the darks first, then I'm going to do the lights. Now, if you're anything like me, you don't have time to be looking through all these tags how to wash this, how to wash this that. So I keep it simple. When it comes to my darts, I always wash them in cold water. Always, that keeps the colors from running. It just works for me. I keep them, you just do it that way, and no problem at all. Now with my whites, and I add the bleach into it, I typically do those on hot water. I'm not worried about no colors fading, throw it in there, kills all the bacteria, Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. So, the products that we're going to be using today, I have three of them. Of course, we need this bleach. I use the Clorox brand here. Takes all the stains, keeps my clothes, just keep them pearly white. Next thing I always use is this OxyClean Odor Boosting Packs. Drop two of those in a heavy load, you're good to go. Nice little fragrance scent, like a fresh cool? burst form type scent. And the last thing, you can't forget about this fabric softener. I always drop a little bit of this gain in there, about a cap full in there, to do the trick. And, and that's all you need, that's all you need. Just those three simple ingredients. Hey, get your clothes fresh and clean. So the next step, I'm about to take these clothes and put them in the washer. But first, like I said, we're gonna start with that dark load. I'm going to show y'all how I put them in there, how much of all of these products to put in there. So we're going to jump into it. All right, guys. So we're here at the next step. All you have to do, make sure first that there's nothing in none of your clothes pockets before you even throw them inside the washing machine. You know, make sure there's no pins or anything in there. Make sure all your socks and all your clothing is, is turned inside out. You don't want no balled up socks up in there because those things will not get washed. So we're just gonna drop two of these bad boys in there and take a cap full of this game fabric softener. Pour that in there. And we're gonna start this washing machine up. After this, once I get it started, it's gonna take about 45 minutes and we'll be back with the next part. All right, guys, we're back. Finished with the first load. Now I'm putting in this white load. We're gonna do the exact same thing. Drop two of these balls in here. Add a cap full of that game. Fabric softener. And I'm gonna pour a little bit of that bleach in here, the Clorox bleach. All righty. So I'm gonna get this going. I'm gonna wash it on hot this time. Make sure it get nice and clean. And I'm gonna go over here to this dryer. Alrighty guys, we're back here. We're here to the dryer portion. I already put my clothes up in there and got them right. Now the only thing I like to add in here, this game brand here, these fabric sheets, they do the job just well. And also, when you're using a dryer, always check the lint trap. 
This one is pretty good right now, so it don't need too much cleaning, but always check that, okay? That's fundamental. And drying in your clothes. And I'm gonna just take two of these fabric sheets here, throw them in there, get it nice and clean. And we're gonna have these dry for 60 minutes. After 60 minutes, they should be done ready and we're gonna jump over to the folding process. So I'm finally back, finished up all of these clothes. I folded up majority of them. You think that but was cool? before I end this tutorial, I noticed some people how they came across, you know, they always have problems on folding. Not so much as the folding, but folding their clothes and then having enough space to fit all their clothes in their drawer. So I'm gonna demonstrate how I fold my shirts. Instead of just the typical way, you know, most people may just have it like that. Fold it over. Most people I know, they do it like that. But I'm gonna show you a more efficient way to save some space while you're folding. All you gotta do with this, I'm gonna take both sides fold them inward so it looks like that I'm going to do that with the other side too flip that sleeve over flip it over all right so you know you do it right if you fold your shirt like that and then the next step I'm just going to flip and roll it so compared to how it looked first Roll it like that, you have enough space. So I'm gonna demonstrate one more shirt for you. So you guys get that idea. You have that here, flip in the back side. So you're gonna have it like you this that was cool? and this. That's how you know you got it. And then you just roll. Just get that finished product. So I think that's all I have to share with you guys on my normal laundry routine. I want to thank you guys for staying tuned, watching the whole video. Be sure to like, subscribe, hit that notification button, and drop a comment. Let me know what else you guys want to see, what other routines or anything you want to see. Drop that in that comment below, and I'll see y'all next time. Everything in it, Chico. Uh, the world is mine. Uh, I think it's Scarface. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's Scarface. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rose. I want the world and everything in it, Chico. Uh, the world is mine. Uh, I think it's Scarface. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's Scarface.